Even though Canada hasn't had the greatest reputation and relationship with First Nations, I still feel that it's my responsibility because it's my homeland to, uh, to serve it at the utmost respect and uh, honor. People often ask me, like, do you think there's really a need for the Adler program? But then those people are probably disconnected from, from the reality of what it's like in an Indigenous community. So I think the ILO program is a great trial year to see what the military could be like. I wanted to try the military and I was like, well this is like an introduction year, so if I want to try the military, this is probably the best way to do it. It is a, it's a big step to take, and it's, it is a great opportunity. And if you have that like calling inside saying you want to go, like do something a bit different or big, then this is a good chance to do it. Like you, you come and you travel around, you meet all kinds of different walks of life. It's just an opportunity to get out and see what you can do. And that's what I really love about Iloy. It gives them an insight to what they're capable of and what they can do. And that can-do attitude can take people a lot of places, whether it's in the military or on the civilian side. The major incentive to come here and not pay for education, that was huge for myself. ILO is an Indigenous Leadership Opportunity Year, and opportunity should be highlighted more because it's nothing but opportunity. things that I see uh, for candidates coming in. A lot of them don't really know what RMC is, so you kind of come in blind a lot of the time. And a big thing that kind of takes people out off the bat is the culture shock. It's the switching of the gears from what they're used to. So that is the biggest challenge, waking up early, you know, doing physical training, going to class, doing military training and then having your, just your hours dictated to you. It was very overwhelming. The first few weeks uh, within uh, RMC uh, during ILOI, it's, uh, we call it orientation period. It's, uh, it's military training, so it's very scheduled. Uh, from 0530 to 1100 at night, their day is busy. I think the first thing that went through my mind and, and my peers' mind was, well, what did I get myself into? But after a little while, as, as um, I started to catch on to our daily, our daily program and, our, and the disciplines of RMC, then um, I felt that I was in good hands. I had faith in my leaders. Um, I may relate to them right away that they have an opportunity and they have the potential to be an officer in the Canadian Armed Forces. And that potential piece comes from them, but um, it's also there on me to get it from them, to get their potential. Go! Education at RMC is, uh, it's a lot of time management and it's, it's learning, it's the ability to learn every single day. We had tutors throughout the whole year, so if we were struggling with our classes, like we had math, chemistry, English, they could help us with that. RMC's academics in regards to our professors, our mentors, our tutors, and our peers are some of the best in our nation. I spent a lot of time in the gym because our gym facilities are excellent, like probably the best gym I've ever been to. As these opportunities, chances to travel, chances to experience new things and take challenges to a new level, that encouraged more participation. I really like the cultural aspect. I got to learn about smudging and uh, sweat lodges. The elders, they offer a lot of teachings 
teach the students uh, how to smudge. We conduct uh, ceremonies like uh, sweats. We go to powwows. And uh, recently we just finished uh, making our hand drums and we're gonna do a birthing ceremony. What really drew me to Iloy was the, initially was a one year contract, was, it seemed like a good deal because I wasn't sure how far I wanted to go with it and jumping straight into say ROTP was a really big commitment at the time. It's a free year, there's nothing, there's no obligations, you don't owe anybody anything, this is your, you're, you're uh, doing this for you. Who knows what Iloy is supposed to be, each year is unique to itself. These programs are, even, even though they're not perfect right now and you know they're off, they're, they're always being worked on, they're improving, uh, they're always an open door for people to come back. Year by year, brick by brick, it'll become what it's supposed to be. I say just try it out, try the Iloy program because we get so many opportunities here. I've woken up many mornings and thought, how much can I achieve today? Don't let your days at RMC go by fast. Don't let your days at Iloy go by fast because they're some of the best.